So my Sundays usually start off with musical rehearsal and then as soon as I get home, I say hi to my dog, of course, she's always a warm, fluffy friend to greet, and head to my room and just exhale, man. It's just been a long day of rehearsal, lots of fun though. And I always like to eat some sort of snack before dinner because I'm usually kind of hungry. So I'm eating one of my favorite Think Thin protein bars. They're great. Hey, Freddie! What? Can we go on the boat? Sundays are usually me and my brother's day where we go on the boat and go for a little sunset boat ride. It's just kind of a way to start off the week exhale take it all in listen to some music and just jam out it's just so nice something to do on the weekend one little last hurrah for the weekend <laughs> As the sun starts to set that's when I know all right it's time to go back in and do everything else you gotta do so the Oscars were on this past Sunday night so me and my family had a little viewing party and we had some Italian food we usually have pastas on Sunday night it's just I don't know what about you guys what do you have on Sunday night dinners <laughs> And since I'd showered that morning before rehearsal and we hadn't done anything really sweaty, it was just a lot of acting, I decided to straighten my hair and not wash it because I don't like to wash my hair every night. Um, so I was just straightening my hair so it's all good for school the next day because I want to make it easy as possible to wake up and just go to school. And I think it's super important to tidy up the day and your room, especially because your room is your sanctuary. And if it's not intact, you won't be intact. Trust me, I know. So... I started by tidying up. I just had a ton of clothes thrown everywhere, bags, random things, unpacked things from sleepovers and such, and just cleaned my room so I have an easy and nice study space. So, to start off the studying and homework, because yes, it is a Sunday night, I light a candle and I go on Spotify, and my favorite playlist right now is Your Favorite Coffee House. I really suggest it. And, um... I started out by responding to some YouTube comments because I post videos every Wednesday and Sunday so I always like to see what you guys had to say and then it is down to business. I pull out my planner and look at the week and what work I have to do for the day before. Just I try and plan as much as I can like okay what am I going to have this week like what are my biggest tasks going to be so then I don't go into the week with a blind eye because you want to know what you have to conquer and then I always like to take out this book and just look at some sort of inspirational quote so I can get ready because I need it and then we just work 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 as much as we need to and once we're done with that I definitely go on social media like my Instagram my snapchat my Twitter so make sure to follow me on Twitter I'm always posting like updates inspirational quotes dancing videos of me retweeting you guys it's so much fun I just love connecting with you guys on social media and then I think it's super important to pack your bag for the next day so I'm putting my laptop my planner my libretto for the musical all in my backpack packing it all up so in the morning I just have to pick it up and leave and I also like to pack a protein bar in my bag so during the day at school if I get hungry I have a little snack so and my keys of course And it's always super important to pick out your outfit the night before so that when you wake up in the morning super tired, you don't just throw on pajamas and you actually look pretty professional and ready to take on the week. And now for a shower, I'm just removing all of my makeup and I'm using a shower cap because I'm not washing my hair and it's just nice to wash off your body and get all clean and I don't know, just feel refreshed to go to bed. I don't know guys. <laughs> And two products that I love right now is this body wash from Nevea. It's super calming. And then this face wash from First Aid Beauty. Then when I'm done with my shower, I go straight and make myself a cup of tea. So I thought this cup was perfect. You do you. You know, start off the week right. You do what you, what's right for you. Putting a little milk in there because tea is really calming, especially for me at night. And finally, I am comfy cozy in my pajamas, ready to head into bed. 
Um, I like to do a little bit something for myself since I was just doing a ton of work. I like to put on a face mask on Sundays nights. It's kind of like my thing for Sunday nights. And I'm just putting this one on. And while I have the face mask on, I'm really into watching TED Talks like for entrepreneurs. And just there's different ones that you can find that just kind of kind of can inspire you for the week ahead and it just makes me feel a lot more productive and inspired too and I just get really into it TED talks are really fun to watch I'm not just saying this like I love TED talks like they're so much fun then I take my mask off and my skin's feeling super refreshed and nice and like oh thank you Danielle then it's super important to turn off all technology before bed because you don't want to be stimulated by it so and I put my alarm on for the next morning and I do it at 604 I don't know why it just makes me feel better like I got four extra minutes and then I put my phone on airplane mode and in the charger and that's about it for technology Lavender is well known for its healing properties and aids you to kind of have that slow wave sleep. I've loved this one from doTERRA. You can just put it on the bottom of your feet because apparently the bottom of your feet has the biggest pores so it can kind of help calm you. Then I like to end my night by reading a nice book until I get super tired and I just clap off my lights and I'm ready for the week. Good night guys. Love you.